Ladies and gentlemen, we just opened the most powerful card in the Vintage Cube. Bane Slayer Angel. Bane Slayer Angel. Thank you. Some elf. Thanks so much for the reset, buddy. I appreciate you. I do like a Mox Diamond. God, I'm also a sucker for Mystic Confluence, but I feel like blue decks have really been just shitting on me. What do we do? Stop, Playboy. Just be double negative and then you're positive. That's true. I don't even know how to do that. That's wild. I would give the feedback that it's better content when it's only like that's see that's what I'm trying to go for. I don't know what to take here. It's either this or this or this. <sighs> Forcing white weenie in the cube seems real scary. I feel like it's draw a tree speaker here. Like we haven't done green yet. I'm taking the tree speaker, man. We're going green. And then there's like nothing good green here. I could have a force of negation to go with my mystic confluence, but no. I was Thank stupid. You. I was foolish. Even my blood type is B negative. What does that mean? B neg oh, B negative. I get it. That's funny. See, that's funny. Brett, you're surprisingly quick, buddy. I do like a wall of blossoms. No, I don't. I don't know why I said that. I do like a thief of sanity and a force of negation. I think I'm a force of negation. Eureka is terrible. Thank I'm you. definitely not second pick at that. Coming back to seven after hiatus for financial reasons. Oh, dude, I make dance. Thank you so much, buddy. I appreciate you. I'm glad your financial hiatus is, or financial uh, reason is over. I'm going to take this. Maybe. You guys like that? I need to make a bigger camera f just for that. I'm going to take force. If they, I swear, if they, God, where are the green cards? Recurring Nightmare? What's Recurring Nightmare? Dear Dad, thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. I'm going to take Recurring Nightmare here. And... Dryad could be decent. Breeding Pool could be fine. We're going to take Dryad. Big carnals. I think we're still trying to live the green dream, but it's not looking great so far. Terastodon, sure. I'm forcing it. We're forcing the green. Living death. Hangerback's not bad with recurring nightmare. Let's take a hangerback walker. It's not exciting. I'm in a Zoom meeting with my students, except none have shown up yet. Guess I'm hanging here until... Nice. I'll be your waiting room. Sitting in the waiting room. You guys know that Fugazi song? <coughs> oh, overgrown. You think Ian McKay would would mind if I uh if I played some Fugazi on stream? Oh wait, oh wait, oh wait, oh wait. Sundering Titan is okay. We can Recurring Nightmare that dude. Well, maybe we're reanimating. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, Placid Laughter. So you're only holding the uh, you're only holding the meeting for the kids who might need it for for the students who might need it. 
It's not like a mandatory meeting. Got it, got it. That's pretty good then. It's basically your your remote your mobile office hours. If you want to show up, that's cool. I'll be here. It's my office hours. If not, that's cool. Like I'll go home. I don't know what's going on with this deck, guys. It's very bad. This does not look like Storm. Hey, buddy, listen. You draft Storm on your own time, you cookie-sending biscuit. Got him. Fuck, got him so bad. Kerwin, I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean that. Or did I? I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait. Mishra's Factory. I think we're just taking Woodfall Primus. I love a Woodfall Primus. I couldn't find a single cookie emote. Dang. I don't know if they're... I don't know if they... Oh. Oh, boy. Just when I think I'm out, they pull me back in. Let's be honest, reanimating Carnage T is scary. Dude, Carnage Tyrant is no joke. It's gotta be better than it's gotta be better than Elvish Mystic. It just has to be. I'm sorry. Now I have some waiting room stuck in my head. Thanks a lot, Placid Laughter. Unbelievable. I kinda just want Beast within here? No, I'm on ultimate price, right? Ultimate price is just better, I think. There's so many creatures that I just want to kill in this format. And when they don't die, I get sad. I'm going to be honest, Buried Alive seems decent here. We have a re recurring nightmare. I do like a Choops. Maybe we're not green ramp. Maybe we're green. We're, maybe we're, we're Sultai reanimate, huh? Take the primal command, then wait for a thousand year storm. See, that's hilarious. That's topical. Because that's what happened yesterday. Kurt, you'll be pleased to know that I have been saving vintage cube drafts to post weekly when the vintage cube draft is gone. I'm going to take Choops. Oh, I'm going to take Hissing Quaggles. Yeah, I think mana's important here. Prowler can go in the main deck. Marsh Flats? Oh, Verdant Catacombs is probably better than Marsh Flats, right? Because it's two of our colors. <laughs> Sitting in the waiting room. I'll just subscribe to later insurance. It's not making it easy on mobile. Dang it. Yeah, I hear donations are not easy on... Donations and subscribing are both not easy on mobile devices. Violated Gorilla, man. I appreciate it, though. I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait. I'll wait. Time goes on the drain. Makeshift Mannequin actually seems fine here. We actually plan bear rights and we have a stirring wildwood. I think I want warm coil though. I go back to work on Monday. I don't work in essential. Oh Christ! Demand the hype. I'm so sorry, buddy. Please, please stay safe. 
Ooh. Oh, oh, we didn't take a burial rights. We have a verdant and overgrown and a hissing fire. That's pretty good. I think damnation's probably good here. Arena seems okay. Oh, the buried alive came back. Oh, so did Maelstrom Pulse, though. I'm going to take Maelstrom Pulse. That kills everything. Oh, Murderous Rider came back? Wow, that's top tier, man. Oh, Noble Hierarch seems nice. Especially with an Oko. And there's nothing else in this pack other than like an Ugin, but Ugin's not really on our... Is he celebrating his birthday? And is he willing to do an ASMR step? <laughs> I have no idea. I cannot speak for Mike B. He is working, though. He has a job. So. That's where Michael is. That's where Michael is. Oh, Channel seems interesting. So does Mana Crypt. What in the earth? This actually is a tough choice. I think because of our mana restrictions, it's less tough because... Here's the thing. Like, we have uh, Oko, which is only one colorless. Phyrexian Red, one colorless. Maelstrom Pulse, one colorless. So Mox Crypt, or Mana Crypt, is basically just like a, a an off-color Mox uh, that has the potential to deal you three damage a turn, where Channel is, like, real good. I definitely don't think it's Mana Crypt not close. I definitely think it's... I don't think it's not close at all. I mean, I think turn two channel into like a, an Eldrazi is going to win you just as many games as a Mana Crypt in, in those early turns. Yeah, I, I think not close is dismissive. I'm going to take channel, actually. And then I'm going to take Emrakul. <laughs> Thank you. Because uh, YOLO. Yep, that seems good. This pack's also gas. Like Ashiok, Garrick, and Gristlebrand in here still. Yep, taking an Emrakul. And that's why I don't think it's very close. Or I think it's close, rather. That's why I think it is close, rather. Oh, Nissa. Okay. Oh, um, actually, Anime didn't Wall of Roots also very good. Jeez, this pack is nice. <laughs> we see Frank in his natural habitat. It's it's true. Oh, Nissa is pretty nice. I mean, we don't have any early plays, though, so I kind of like Wall of Roots, but I also like Animate Dead as well, because um, obviously we want to be discarding these fat idiots. I'm going to take Animate Dead. I think it's just better in this deck. Well, we have a discard outlet on Unus Prowler. I mean, we'd like to have another one for sure, but, like... There's Grave Daddy. Oh, Finhorn Elves is actually... Demir Signet's actually nicer than Finhorn Elves, I think, because it does let us play Oko just like Noble Hierarch. Oh my god, Katie's yelling at me for having the fan on. Katie, yes, I have a fan on. Do you, can you hear it? Can you guys hear it? God, I really need to implement that noise that noise uh, gate. I li I just moved it. It was actually facing the uh, it was facing the mic a little more. Now it's now it's facing. Oh, your hair was just blowing in the wind. Was it really? Oh, that's funny. Yes, yes, I I did have a fan on, and that's what it was. I can hear the fan I have on. I don't know if that's the same. 
I'm gonna take this gear. Oh, Putrid Imp is a discard outlet, even though it's just terrible. DJ Fap City, did you say that? I think I thought it was because it was an action because I was in an action movie. Um and I didn't ignore you. Oh my god. I hate when you guys say I ignored you just because I didn't see the message. Like there's so much going on. God, it hurts my feelings. Um, Future Trip is terrible, right? We have Animate Dead, Recurring Dead, Recurring Nightmare, and Makeshift Mannequin. Well, I guess we're taking Future. <gasps> How lucky. I wish this I wish this Liliana came back, but unfortunately we're probably going to see either Fire Blast or Mishra's Factory. As oh, we're going to probably see Lyra as last pick. I want to take in Tomb, guys. You know my greeting, and now I'm sad. How could you? Dang it. Oh, biscuits. I'll just take this member. Dang it, Josh. I don't know if we even play Oko. I don't know if our fixing is good enough. We have Demir Signet, Noble Hierarch. No way to get a blue source outside of that, unfortunately. So I think Oko is a probably an easy cut here. I ignored a new sub. Morlock, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. Dang it. There's so much going on, guys. Oh, yeah. Dryad of Elysian Groves, too. That's true. So those are the three, then. Uh, Pernicious Dude. Or Deed. And Dark, Peti Dark Petition. This did used to be a wholesome place. I don't know what happened. Oh, Necromancy came back? Yeah, uh, she's gonna take necromancy. Like when I said to check your PayPal. Oh, buddy, I get email notifications. Sunny D, he are you? Are you Corey? Oh my God! Now you guys are going crazy right now. You guys are wild. You also had dried for we just said that. We already went, oh! That's exciting. That's exciting. Yes, yeah, so we have Noble, Demir, and Dryad. Those are the three ways we have to cast an Oko. I don't think that's good enough. If we had a breeding pool or a tropical island to get with our verdant catacombs. Katie's saying more things. Frank is new to the whole streaming thing. Cut him some slack. Wow. Wow. Katie literally messaged me and she's like, I'm saying things in chat. <laughs> I'm just like, okay, hold on. Let me check. Good gravy. <sighs> Katie, just to be clear, that is a meatball, pepper jack, and mayo sub. Wow, Wheel of Fortune was not a card I expected to be on the wheel. Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait. I wake up every morning knowing that today is the day I put my heart out and Frank ghosts me. How dare you? I would never. I don't think Recurring Nightmare makes the cut here. Maybe it does. Actually, maybe it does. God, two cuts. I don't know if we have enough creatures for Recurring Nightmare. If we can cut Hanger back and Recurring Nightmare, we're probably in good shape, right? Because now we can just rely on Entomb, Putrid and Bonus Prowler, Necromancy, all the things. You, 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 you. <laughs> yeah, I see it. <laughs> oh, crying out loud. You try to raise them right, you know, and then they... It's all downhill. 
Like, the creatures we could realistically sack to uh, Recurring Nightmare. It's this guy. This guy. We only have, like, six creatures that we can realistically sack to a Recurring Nightmare. That just doesn't seem like enough. I guess Murderous Rider if we just play him as a man. Alright, just do it like this. We'll see if we need it. keep this hand if we draw channel boy we're going ham skilled swine my dude and if we don't brutal we gotta actually put overgrown tomb in case we draw Frixian arena that'll never happen guys that'll never happen the turnip predictor is predicting bad news for me this week. Well, biscuits. So long, Noble. Wow, this is, a, this is an exciting start you got here. My man. If we draw another land, we can just play Garrick on turn four. It's pretty good. Turn three? It's pretty good. Just read and comment on your article. Was a good read? Don't really, didn't realize how bad it was. Yeah, it's rough, dude. The companions are brutal. Channel, channel, channel. We didn't chant hard enough, but that's okay. We should have just chanted harder. That's the only way. Gonna play a Gary. Do I just make two wolves or do I kill this? I'll kill this guy because we don't actually have... Um, there's, they have no pressure, so not super. I can just make more wolves forever. Maybe compared to having a companion, you're essentially starting with eight cards. It's literally the whole crux of my argument, Smokey Loki. So I feel like you didn't read my article this week, which makes me really sad. Just feels really, uh, it just feels really hurtful that you would do that. So I want to post it in the chat so you guys can read it if you'd like. Putrid Impo. channel oh that's a wormy boy the wormy it's the worm it was the wormiest of boys well it's unfortunate because they're just gonna bounce it with the rifty boy but i guess like if we don't play it they bounce something else so putting the value on the board okay Thank you. Oh my god, Adam with the gifted subs, my dude. What is your deal? Adam. Thank you, my dude. Thank you. You are on a you are on a, a tear, man. I appreciate you, buddy. Thank you. 
Yeah, we read it. We agree. Hey, buddy, listen. This is why you're not getting your stand. This is why you're not getting your draft recap. Because your attitude. You. you need to adjust it. Adam, dude, you are awesome. Alistair Kane. Thank you. With the ten gifted subs. What a what a what a saint. What an absolute Saint Alistair. Thank you. Send them on down to Rat Thank train. you. Have you ever been outside and got to call on the rat trick? <laughs> Thank you. I don't know what they're doing right now. One, two, three, four. They have six mana, huh? Thank you. Fortunately, Badger isn't here to one-up it. Fortunately for the stream, unfortunately for me. You know what I mean? Thank you know what I'm saying? You. Yeah, Badger is ridiculously uh, generous when it comes to gifting subs. Send them on down to rap train. <sighs> yeah. Oh boy. I'm probably just gonna sacrifice noble hierarchy here if that's their if that's their choice. Yep. Discard gains flying. Do, 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 do. I mean Dryad's good for our mana, it's just bigger than Noble Hierarch and Putrid Imp is a discard outlet in case we draw. Thank you! You know, some fat daddy. Oh, that's good. Now we just get to kill Liliana. Well, we did this. We did. Did we did draw one, two, three, four, five, six? We did draw a fat daddy, but you know. Oh, gifted a sub to Cosmo Kramer. Beautiful. Sub before getting a gifted one. Is that is that what happened? Did you did you, Michael? Hmm. Ah. 90, 98 inch 8k tvs oh jesus <laughs> oh god one two three four five six seven like i feel like we just discard the emerical Kill the lily. Like, we're going to discard it anyway, right? So. And play Warning Boy. You. They only have one card in hand, so that's pretty nice. Denmark, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. 22 months? We're almost at the two-year mark. What a time to be alive. Was that M? No. Is it Thank you. N? No. W? Yes, W just does the automatic. Okay. That's good to know. Water Sports Drew. What's up, my dude? Welcome back. Oh dang. So it turns out going Lotus Lurus Lotus is just as broken as Mangu said in your article. And all I had to do was take Oh dang it. I hate it when the messages are too short. Alright, we're just gonna pass. We both have one card in hand. Hold on, let me see what my open open old streamline and see what Adam said. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, biscuits. And all I had to do is take Bolus of Citadel out of Storm and switch to Brain Freeze. Yeah, that's all you gotta do. It's, it turns out when you can just recast Black Lotus every turn with that eighth card that's always in your opening hand. Huh. At the risk of being too forward, wanted to thank you so much for YouTube vids. My mom's in the ICU with COVID and your vids. Dude, Water Sports Drew. My God, I'm so sorry, man. Wow, it's really something because like you see all like these bullshit posts on like Facebook or Twitter or wherever where people are like trying to deny it and they're like, well, it's, ha it's not as bad as they say. Do you even know anybody who's ha who it's happened to? And like that's literally like I got a YouTube comment from someone who said that an absolute, an absolute moron. And uh, it's so it's it's. 
kind of shitty that I guess I can say I do know someone who has it. Water sports true, man. I'm so sorry, dude. What's happening? Two mana. Dismember. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I mean, they can almost actually activate Urza twice a turn, which is pretty good. I have a good friend at the Central Bulgarian Military Hospital. <laughs> Fuck, dude. 14% of the people in New York City have... That's insane, dude. That's, like, the most ridiculous number I can even... Like, it's not the most ridiculous. Obviously, like 100% is the most ridiculous. But, like... That's so high. That's so unreasonably high. Okay, they're activating Urza. Mountain. Now they can definitely activate twice. Huh. So I think we're going to necker... Oh, we can't do both, actually, because we don't have seven mana. Well, that's pretty wild. We could just necromancy worm coil engine, I guess. <clears throat> just sort of non-creature permanent. Doesn't really even do much here. Let's get in there with old Deathy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So you can activate twice. Yeah, like, they're basically drawing three cards with Urza every turn if they have nothing to do. The question is, do I discard, discard Woodfall Primus first? Like, I'd have to draw two lands. Dude, Oral, that's awesome, dude. The problem is, Idem Nation, like, we don't have money. anything here. Salt stipulation. All the Gotham's only two win conditions. It's okay if you lose. Let's unload some of that salt on the community. Power fixing, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to pass one turn. I'm going to give them a, a more of an option to play more creatures out. Dude, Fred Camper, thank you so much, dude. I appreciate you, buddy. I gotta write this down. <laughs> Doesn't matter if you lose. Fantastic. That's all I want to hear. I just want the pressure off, man. It's so it's too high. Wait, close that for a second. Let's make sure this doesn't pop up. And it would have. God, so many informations just popping up around the screen. What do I have under the sea stuck in my head? Can someone explain it to me? Did someone say something under the sea like? I don't understand. 
Uh, all right. Creaming tar pit. Sure, that's good. Oh, what up, Jundasaur? Because it's dope. It is just a banger. You guys are right. That is a woodfall target. I gave a presentation in a socially distanced conference room with a mask and thought I was going to die. Uh, and one damage to each creature. It's hmm, pretty good. Wait, did they play a land? Oh, they played a mountain and then they... No, wait. What happened? Huh. I like that we get to keep this this fat this fat daddy. Just this guy, huh? <sighs> Necromancy. Blocking city. All right, I'll sack my woodfall promise. Oh, he's going to come back. Oh, congrats on adopting a dog, dude. Perfect time to do it. Um, in case we draw Terastodon, I want to be able to play it. For just $5 a month, Mike gets fresh food and water in his bowl. And for every 10 gifted subs, his cage is cleaned. He's given new clothes, and for 20 gifted sub, Frank will let him out for two hours of stream time or recreational time. <laughs> I can't make those promises. Two hours, uh, two hours a day is a lot. Okay, so they activated the Pluto Delta. So they get to do something else now. That's pretty good. All right, we win the game. Dude, dismember's coming in for that Urza. Informer, you know, smell in the sound. Submitting 41. Thank you. That ain't it. Oral, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. Mulligan. 
keep. Uh, you're okay. You're better than this one. Ship imp. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Emrakul. Draga tree speaker. That was a good turn. Don't die. Fucking Christ. <laughs> you didn't have this all last game, but this time because I have a tree speaker on turn two. Of course you fucking have it. This is what I mean. I'm sorry. This is what I'm fucking talking about. Brutal. Just brutal. All I need is I need any big fat idiot so we can go Signa to Una's Prowler. Outrage! Uh He's so mad. He's so angry. I got five mana. He's so grumpy. He is grumpus. He is the most grumpus there's ever been. They hold they hold a grumpus contest every year. Come on, dude. <laughs> Avalanche Riders. Give me an Emrakul one time. I don't ask for much. Just want an Emrakul. Why can't I have my Emrakul? <laughs> oh man have a cookie i have like two and a half cookies left dude those cookies are slow to eat man it's really like all right i'll get it back god you're really doing a terrible job at killing my resources here Uh, Kerwood sent edibles, if you mean edible cookies. Yes. I guess we'll play Una's Prowler here. Get busy prowling, prowling every day. Oh, look at that. Look at that beautiful chicken. Wait, what's happening right now? <laughs> Fingy. Stop saying fingies. God. Let a man bite his nails in peace. Nah, she right. Are you thinking of killing my Una's Prowler with one of your last two cards? You take the good, you take... Yes, yes, they were. You got it. You take it all and then you have the facts of life. The facts of life. Um, One more mana and we can actually go Maelstrom Pulse this guy and then Necromancy it back to life. I will bring you back to life. I mean, we got we got time to take damage here. Do you play some arena on then? Heck yes, I do. I'll be playing arena later today with uh, with Super Fritz's Fires of Invention Ultimatum deck. 
Oh, daddy's just looking for a terastodon. Is that right? Oh, man. The problem is, like, I don't want to take too much damage. I think if we take another hit, we're actually priced out of Ulamog. Like, what are, what are the odds if we just get this Rekindling Phoenix that goes the distance? Like, we can go Maelstrom Pulse Necromancy. Well, they have to have removal in hand, right? Like, the there's... Yeah, like they have to sack the the egg at the beginning of the next turn. Then they're never getting it back. Like that's not how Phoenix works. How many disinfection egg disinfectants did you inject today? Not enough, unfortunately. All right, we're gonna do it. I think it's one of our best shots at not dying because at a certain point, like channel just becomes too pricey. Um. Wait, why didn't the sacrifice? What? If there's no target, it doesn't sacrifice? That's weird. I don't know. That's a weird way to... It just says at the beginning of your upkeep, sacrifice this creature and return target creature and we're kindling Phoenix from your grave to the battlefield. I feel like the, the sacrifice shouldn't be dependent on whether there's a target or not. I feel like it should sacrifice and then you get to choose the target, but that's weird that it didn't do that. Legal targets, no legal targets to choose for elemental. That's weird. All right, well. Then I guess we're on a, on a wing and a prayer. Yep, yeah, all right. Wait, oh. Oh, that worked out really well. <laughs> now I get an egg, buddy. It's my egg, buddy. Alright, well. Emery with no artifacts. Hitting Golos and Solemn Simulacrum and Smokestack. Wow. Oh, wow. Dismember? <laughs> How does he do it? How does he do it? <sighs> I attacked with my egg.
well, that's worse. But, you know, without anything to do. My kingdom for a go for the throat. Yeah, I do what I can. Get in there with the elemental. We're having a good time. We're just cube drafting, guys. The problem is we have five mana, so like our draws are not very live, and also our they're just not good. Oh well, I guess they got a little better. That's not it's not bad. It kills a creeping tarpeet. Attack with the egg token. Bring it on back. Uh oh. Uh oh. What are they doing? Sure. This actually might help us. Yep. Let's get rid of Terastodon. <laughs> oh yeah, they're definitely they're still coming at us. That's great. Now we don't have to waste our murderous rider. Get him. Inferno Jet? I don't even know what that card does, to be honest with you. Oh, that was perfect. I like that they didn't activate Urza in response with no cards in hand. That's a that's a perk for us, my dude. This is actually great against Liliana too, which is kind of funny. One, two, three. Dryad of Elysian Grove. Black. Murder is a rider. Play the dude. Thank you. Some Franks have all the luck. Some Franks have all the luck. Boom, 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 boom. Man, they're doing really well. You see the video I posted? Dimitri, I have not seen it yet, actually. I did see you posted it. I got the notification on my phone, and then I meant to check it, and then I forgot. That's my bad. That's my bad. Oh, I see Mike Kinsella, though. Oh, this looks fucking legit. Oh, this is real exciting, dude. Oh, yeah. I'm in it. Oh. Well, that's a death sentence. You know what? I think this is probably better than not playing it. This Doretti's a little scary, though. 
I think we're bringing in Hex Mage now that we've seen Doretti as well. <laughs> now I have backward for oh wow, wow. Frank laughs in all directions. That's my laugh in all directions initiative. Not to be confused with the print in all colors initiative of Dunder Mifflin. What a fucking banger, dude. Dude, they sound just as good as they did 20 years ago. It's unreal. Yep. You got it. So now we got a chump block here. Because otherwise we die. Mike Kinsella's voice is always incredible. Land? Worm coil! And an anime dead? Oh, Jesus. These are some things right here, my dude. Harassed it on. Pop three of my lands in the arena, maybe. I have a <laughs> oh, egg, Frank. Dude, everything Mike Kinsella's voice and the guitars in every in every band he's in give me such feels from like early twenties. Just driving around and like hanging out with friends. Like it's so wild. It's so wild how like they, there's such an effect. Oh, anime dead. I mean they could sack something with Doretti to get bit of big Terrastan on. They can make a sacrifice a token. Then we still have two three threes. I feel like anime dead is the play. I mean, I don't even think we can get rid of these, to be honest. Because this also lets us um, activate Hissing Quagmire if needed be. I'd kill Magic Arena. I killed Magic Arena. Oh, I love Cursive too. Yeah, Cursive is amazing as well. Oh man, I just want to listen to this right now, dude. Bing, ding, ding, bing, ding, 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 ding. Oh, you're just gonna draw Riffling Cloudscape. Solid. Solid top deckaroo. Oh, bye bye, little Sebastian. Are you not a fan of Ikoria? I, I enjoy Ikoria as a set. I think it's been fun. I, I will never choose a standard legal like draft set over a cube, though, ever. The interaction is just not even close to. All right, well, we're now we're hoping we draw a makeshift mannequin. <sighs> okay. What did they sack? A mox jet. Okay, sure. I have two three threes now. I will take one damage. Makeshift mannequin off on the top. That's the swamp. Gonna play it. Now we're dead. Concede the game. I mean, to be fair, they could have, like, dereadied our worm coil engine. Or, or uh, well, you know, if we just had worm coil last turn, they could Liliana make a sack of worm coil, deready kill the lifelinker, and then we're just in the same situation. <laughs> we're in the same situation, except for we have, um. 
Ultimate Price doesn't seem as good as Vampire, Vampire Hex Major. I did see the Parks and Rec reunion. I'm really excited about it. That sounds amazing, dude. Um, You know what? I'll keep this hand. I feel like it's doing the thing that I want it to be doing. And I feel like we're probably going to... Um, we're probably going to get there. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I'm having faith. I guess it would be nice if I could. It's next Thursday? Oh, wow. I didn't think it was that soon. I didn't read the article. I actually just saw the headline and I was like, oh, sweet. That'll probably be like in 10 months. Next Thursday. Don't kill it. Oh, don't do it. I have nothing else to do, so let's see if you got the one mana. <sighs> Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> yep. Green source. Oh, how are you going to do me dirty? Hissing Quagmire did me so dirty. Here's the thing. They're going to untap. They're going to have Incinerate. We're going to Emrakul. We're going to pay one. And then we're going to play 14. We're going to go to three, and they're going to Incinerate. That's going to be the exact thing that happens. I do got to be more specific. I blame myself. Okay, now they're not going to do that. Don't have Lightning Bolt. Oh, you got nothing. All right. You, you did. Maybe they're not dead. We'll see. We'll see who's dead. Take an extra turn after this one. I'm gonna swing with this soon as Prowler. Oh, they lost the game, but that's okay. Emrakul coming out through the channel. What you gonna do? Mm -hmm. That's how you do it. That's how you Emrakul on turn three. Turn four. God, it wasn't even turn, it wasn't even turn two. It wasn't even turn three. It was Emrakul on turn four. Get out of here with that. That's too late. Is that country? No, that was no specific song. That was just a, a random country song that I was I was trying to sound about. Gonna sound about country. Gonna hang in my mind. Let's get my not damn bad. You know, like that. It just sounds like a country song. Thank God it's a country song. You know? Oh, uh, no, this hand seems bad. I don't know what to do. Well, it's not channel times for a thousand years before and the of commanded to main fire. It's true. I'm a simple man. I see a channel and an emerald. Oh, for crying out loud. I can never keep a six card hand, ever. So I just assume that when I mulligan, I'm going to five. Thank you. Oh, Bobby Biscuits with a gifted sub? Thank you so much, dude. Paying forward the gifted sub from Badger? God, community gift community. Community begets community. Beautiful. I thought your name was Bobby Brisket, and now I'm just... <laughs> wow. Apparently your name wasn't good enough for Johnny Big Large and Talls. Should have been a brisket, not a biscuit. Gonna play some blood and sort of fire and ice. Gonna try to kill that creature, but I have no gods in the graveyard. Next turn I'll be able to Maelstrom Pulse. Maelstrom Pulse. I dare you guys to tell me my song is not the best song you've ever heard. Fucking dare you.
Oh, it's a smuggly. Your song so God damn, Monsonster has no chill, dude. No chill whatsoever. It was a risky dare, though. It's true. Do we have damnation in the main deck? Yeah, we do. Oh, Jite. Boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. And I fill your cup. And 10 in the morning and the sun goes down. At 3 in the day. I mean, I wouldn't make it the single, but you could throw it on, on the album like track nine or something. That's all I want. Thank God I'm a chupacabra. See you later, Mom. Mother! Mother! Tell you, giver of runes not to walk my hero blade hold. Oh, well, that's good too, I guess. Oh, mother! I think we did die. I feel like your your assessment is accurate. I'm gonna concede because like even if we kill this and attack Elspeth for two, she goes to one. Uh, they can crew this, equip it. This is three, four, five, six, seven, and then pump it. So we're actually dead right here. So and the sun goes down. I feel like Pernicious Deed is actually pretty good here. Let's bring in a Pernicious Deed. Let's bring in a Dismember, too. Take out Arena. And I'm going to go 41. This hand needs a lot to go right. One in tune would be great. <laughs> um, this is better. It's basically the same hand, except I traded a land and a makeshift mannequin for a noble hierarch. Oh man, those 41s with glasses. That's where to be, bro.
a bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. It's a weird play. Hey, I'll play it again. These are very weird plays. Yikes. I mean, taking my Hierarch is definitely not a time walk. Because <laughs> I still got my next turn. Like, it's one mana. You're preventing me from having one mana. If I, like, tapped out and you were randed it, like, that's more of a time walk. But, like, preventing me from having one mana it's not really a time walk. It's more like a preemptive mana. But you're also wasting this on a shitty creature instead of, like, a good creature. Oh, the, the unexpectedly absent denies me a draw step, sure. But that's, like... I mean... Th this this didn't fairgrounds warden didn't hmm <laughs> yes warden a removal just because these cards took a thing doesn't mean like they did like Oh, that doesn't mean it wasn't a good... It doesn't make it a good play just because it did eat a card, like... Like, if I have a 5-5 five five and I have to kill this with, like, a dismember so I can get through with my 5-5, five five, that doesn't make, like... Like, it doesn't necessarily validate the card. <laughs> Okay, I think I have spells in the deck, actually, somewhere. Boom, ba doom, boom, 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 boom. You have two in your hand. Touche. Touche. Four, five, six, seven. We go to nine here. Uh huh. God, my kingdom for a removal spell at instant speed. A dismember, please. Actually, I, I mean, I would love to just have a. Give me just a good old fashioned ravenous chupacabra. Overgrown too. Give it to me. Excellent. Let me have it. We're also one man away from just casting a Terastodon, so that's a thing. So now we can pretty much cast anything in our deck except for Emrakul and Woodfall Primus. Those are the bad draws. Well, that's something, all right. Weird four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I don't think we can go to two here, so Kapow. So they're going to have four creatures, we'll have three. Yeah, I'm fine with that. And we still have six mana. So again, there's only two cards in our deck that are not playables. Garrick Hunt, Wild Huntmaster, Garrick Huntsman's Cursed Huntsman, or whatever his name is, is, is a good play. Warm Coil is a good play. Let's see, you got Declaration in Stone from Elephants. You got, a you got Face Fetters. Mirror Angel. 
Okay, and pump figure. That seems good. All right. Fantastic. Two, three, four, one, two, three. So we can go block elephant. Blocking figure seems terrible. I don't think we actually have good attacks here. We can attack for four. Yeah, that's actually fine. If we're trading elephant for elephant, it's like, whatever. Yep, that seems fine. Oh, no! Okay, good. Whew, I was afraid we were gonna... I was afraid we were gonna deal the damage to the Thurman Inspector. That would have been less fun. Channel is a pretty bad draw too, and that's true. I mean, there's a lot, of, there's a lot of not great draws. <laughs> Damnation would be decent here, I think. Well, we're going to three. Yep, that makes damnation worse. So does that. Wow. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure we'll draw damnation because of those two. It's okay. It was just a swamp. All right. Shut up and take my money. Oh, what's happening? Stip. I stop saying stop. <laughs> 69, dude. Deck CMC must be 69. X1, 23 playables at 3C. What? <laughs> what? What in the earth? Violet Gorilla, man. I have no idea. That was wild. Hold on. CMC must be 16. X equals 1. 23 playables at 3 convert. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. Our total, our total converted mana cost for the deck must be 69. That seems tough. Okay. Violated Gorilla, man. I appreciate you, dude. Do, do, do. Total deck must be. So X, X equals one, so like Banefire would be two, is what you're saying? To not donate 69 for that. <laughs> or 69, 69. Do, 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 do. I'll give it a shot. It's it's something. Okay, cool. Violated Gorilla, does that, can I, can I, can I not, can I change it during sideboarding? Because it seems like that would be really difficult to, to adhere to during sideboarding. Or just in the main board deck. Oh, okay, I may sideboard out of. Oh, Bomat Courier. Uh-oh. I'm not going to block. Let's draw Una's Pro. <laughs> you can sideboard into reverse Calgary. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. What's even happening right now? <laughs> Why? Do you guys, I did say, you saw me say Una's Prowler before I drew it, right? 
I couldn't think of the name, but I wanted to draw it so that we can go that into this. So I just want to make sure that... I, I want to be validated. I want to make sure that that, that was seen. I got a private gym slot. Oh, Violet Girl, enjoy the gym, buddy. Violet Girl, you want, you want to wait to do this dip until you're here, or do you want me to do it? I can just do it whenever. Let me know, because I'll do it today. Makeshift plus Hexproof is lulls, but Makeshift plus uh, Lifelink is just against the red deck is better lulls, I think. Oh, that's a good trade. I'll trade that. Holy... Whenever I schedule some friendly funny stuff. Okay, cool. So it will be on YouTube then. Violet Grill, I appreciate it, man. Thank you so much, dude. Thank you, thank you for the support. Oh, it's a, it's a big girl. Oh, man, if this guy was still alive, we could discard Emrakul and makeshift mannequin. God, one turn too late. Yep. I got my engine. You're gonna bolt it. That's okay, cause I still get life. Doot, doot, doot. Or I block, I go to 24, I keep a warm coil engine as a 6 6 that touch. Doot, 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 doot. And they could have like a removal spell and they use post blocks so that they guy. Yeah, this seems fine. I'll deal with it. Buh! They might face? No. Wow. Just did an average mana cost for this deck. It will need to be aggressive with only a few five drops at the top end on average. For what deck? What are you saying right now? What are you saying right now? I mean, I think it's better to do four. I think it's better to do six damage and gain three than it is to do four damage and gain four. It's an eight point life swing versus a 12 point life swing, so. I don't think they have that many lands in hand at all because they didn't. They missed the land drop on three and four, so. I'm going to think, no, they don't. I just think Warm Coil was that, was that scary for them. Oh, the 69 deck. XL, so, oh, interesting. It needs to be aggressive in like a few five drops. Oh, okay. I want to know what their plan is now. I don't think they have one. I think they just had to get rid of Worm Coil. Because that's a dude. We won the game. Okay. I think Emrakul Channel is almost a little too scary. I also don't think I want these fat daddies. I think I'd rather have things like Dismember, Vampire Hex Mage, Liliana's Triumph, Pernicious Deed, Tiat Arena. I think Channel's still fine for Warm Coil, but once we get to Channel Emrakul range, like if we've taken any damage, Fire, uh, fire Blast just kills us. So I still think channel is fine in the deck. Thank you. Steven C, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back, my dude. <laughs>
Yikes. Ugh, it's not exciting, but it is what it is. I don't think we're going to play this. I think we're going to just try Pernicious Deed here. Hey, Chief. How you doing? Boom, ba doom, boom, 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 boom. I will dismember a smuggler's copter. Come and knock on our door. We've been waiting for you. Oh wow, they're just gonna bolt us. What a wild world. That doesn't do anything, unfortunately. Lightning bolt. Oh, were they trying to do it again? I'm going to pump a new 2 2 again. What up, Calvin? We've been waiting for you. Where it's Michael B. Every day it's Michael B. too. Never forget how great you are. <laughs> Mike, you are also great, man. I appreciate you. That's wild. I guess we're going to 10 here. Take it to the limit. One more time. On the highway. I'm gonna go to five because I'm absolutely crazy. And I think it's worth it to play Worm Coil here. One, two, three, four, five. Worm City Bench, Worm, Worm City Bench, 2020, 10. Mike, are you in the office? Are you at Blizzard right now? You guys going in? I mean, if they have Burn Spell, Fire Blast, we're dead. If they have Burn Spell, Burn Spell, we're dead. But if we get to swing. And I feel good. And that thing can't attack or block. Oh, now it can. Oh, that's a yikes. I'm one of the few in the office to make sure everything continues to run. God, you're so... You're so valuable. What a valuable member of... Of society. If this is indestructible and I attack, does that mean, like, it doesn't have protection, so the damage still goes through, right? I still gain six. And I go to 11, right? I see you're in the office, too. I am in the office. I'm in the Michael Scott office. This guy can't block, right? So I might as well just attack here. Let's see what happens. Take it to the limit. One more time. Oh, they're just taking it. It's a bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for them. Oh, wow. 
That's man, that's pretty good. That is a pretty, pretty good. Pretty, 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 pretty good. Underworld breach. Okay. Fascinating. Okay, so what's the worst they could do here? If their last card is Fire Blast, they could Fire Blast us twice. No, don't do that. So let's not... Right, like they go Fire Blast, exile three cards, Fire Blast us again. Yeah, I'll just block with Putrid because I don't think Putrid really does that much. And putting us to 17 next turn is probably way stronger. Oh, and they have to sacrifice this at the end step? That's wild. Okay, so they're just literally playing figure. Weird. Does that do anything? Literally nothing. Wow, that's brutal. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 12, 13, 14, 15 with the one if their last card is Fire Blast. I mean, we can't cast Damnation. We only have three mana. Otherwise, I would. And we're at 17. I'm just going to cross my fingers that it's not Fire Blast, I guess. I don't know. Show me a sign. The mana problems are as eternal as Vintage and Legacy. Well, yeah. You got to ask your friend, hey, you mind if I get a discount? I'll take nine and go to eight. Oh, they just draw two here? That's wild. That card's fantastic. Alright, so they don't have Fire Blast, I guess. <sighs> Come on, land. Oh, working for the weekend. Wait, that's working for a living. Take in what they're giving because they're working for a living. <whistles> Quagmire off the top? That sounds about right. Turtles in a half shell. Heroes in a half shell. Turtle. Turtle world. You guys like these songs I'm singing? I don't know what they're doing. Like, they have no plays, right? So, so let me draw my card. <laughs> Is that a clip? Where are the turtles? Oh, that's a clip. All right. I don't know what's going on. Like, this is wild. One worm... What, who wins? Three three red boys or one wormy boy? Turtle World was my childhood. I don't even know what that is. Tick, tick, 
t today, Junior? I don't know what's going on. I guess I'll pause it until I come back for you guys on the YouTubes. Well, guys, anticlimactically, we won that round. So, we can go to return to game somehow. Did they concede? Oh, they just lost the game due to an action. What up, Katie? And chat, everyone else, what's up? Yeah, so they disconnected. Well, we're going to draw. Let's see. Oh, so we could have went land, choops, kill. That was sweet. I didn't really get to watch much. We could have killed this guy, but then they can get it. They can get two blockers back, which is rough. I guess Channel's there's no a way hell to get of a magic around that. card. Channel is a hell of a magic card. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me on twitch.tv slash franklaport, michaelb.com slash franklaport, patreon.com slash franklaport, coolstuffing, and manatraders.com. And I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for watching.